All right, this is Mike with AndroidHeadlines.com, and I'm going to show you a really quick video. I had a semi-request on this one from some people on Google+, wondering about HD wallpapers on on the uh, Galaxy Nexus, because it is a 720p screen. Uh, it's not the first. There are a few others out there, but it's the first of this size. Uh, it's a 4.65-inch screen, I believe, is the size of the screen. It might be the size of the phone. Either way, it does add extra screen real estate, which makes it, you know, a little bit more interesting for the uh, pictures. I've not found a problem, though. I'm using an HD snow wallpaper right now that I found on Google. Uh, that's my recommendation. If you want a wallpaper, you just go to Google. Um, and I'm using Quick Controls here to access my um, URL bar. And what I just do uh, is, in fact, maybe we'll try it with the voice commands, and then I can show you a two-in-one. Cancel, because it started talking. Uh, voice commands. HD wallpaper, black and white. So I'm just going to try to find a very simple wallpaper, and of course, the voice controls are very nice. It found it almost immediately. So we're going to click... Oh, that's the first one. We'll just click that then. Um, actually, that's not going to work for me, because that just took me to... A picture not image results and for this particular demo I want to show you the image results so that takes you to you know a couple images um, maybe it looks like Google needs to fix this problem because there's a little bit of uh, uh, a little bit of space on the side there and I don't know if that's for you know whatever mm, definitely don't want that Apple logo on our nice new Android phone uh, we're gonna go to this cityscape though I actually have this on a different phone so I'm not going to put it on this one at this particular time. Um, and what you do, like I said, is you just search for what you want in Google. Um, I prefer, well, I've found better results if I do HD wallpaper. Um, you might find some less than desirable pictures on here of things that maybe some people wouldn't prefer. Uh, not suitable for work, we'll call them. So turn your uh, safe search on if you are looking and if you don't want to see these. Uh, turn it to strict and then you won't see any of these things. But what happens here, most people would click this image here and figure they have their picture. But this is not their image they want. The one I'm looking for is 1920 by 1200. This is a preview of that image. It's probably something like 400. That's going to look like crap on your HD 720p screen. So you click view full size and that will take you to the real image and we're just loading here. Um, so that'll take you to the actual full-sized image and you can set it as your background. Maybe. Oh, you know what? It's actually, for some reason, downloading that wallpaper. But usually, if you click full-size um, on other ver on other wallpapers. We're going to find another one. Okay, my battery's actually getting low, but that's fine because we're almost done. We will just use this city. Okay, there's a city and the image, the actual image is 1280 by 960, which is perfect for our 720p Galaxy Nexus. Oh, it's downloading both of them. Wonderful. Okay, well, either way, that, that'll that still work. If you download the image, you can find it in your gallery, and then you can set, you can hit the settings button and set picture as wallpaper. That'll set this picture as your wallpaper. Um, I just sized it so it was more full size because I like the whole image, and then I click OK in the corner, and it says setting wallpaper. Then I return to my home screen, and I've got this you know, rainy looking, uh, on purpose, blurry picture because that's the way it was taken in rain and things. So that's kind of a cool image and that's a good way to set HD wallpaper. Um, this has been Mike with Android Headlines showing you HD wallpaper on your new 720p screen on your Galaxy Nexus.